hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is jemima and today we are going to talk about textbooks that i used in my preclinical class those textbooks that helped me a whole lot this is one of my most requested videos so thank you for those who requested for these videos i have it here for you today so just sit tight and watch sorry i'm going to be looking down a lot because like you have seen in my previous video the youtube channels for mbbs student if you've not seen it please go and see it i'll put the link up for you guys to see the video i talked about youtube channels that helped me a lot in my preclinical classes i wrote down the textbooks you can see so i'm ready to like pour out the knowledge for you guys i wrote every single thing down that's how serious i am about this i really want you guys to have those 60s and 70s in your exams so so let's talk about biochemistry one thing i need to understand about my personal experience with biochemistry is that I've, i struggled terribly with biochemistry i don't know biochemistry even till now i can't proudly stand anywhere and say i know biochemistry so these textbooks i downloaded a lot of textbooks trying to find the textbook that would suit me perfectly i wasn't able to find one particular textbook like uh, like when i talked about histology if you've not seen that video please go and see the last video i talked about anatomy textbooks that helped me a lot in my preclinical class please i'll put the link up for you guys go and see it so in um, this biochemistry i don't have one particular textbook that will say I, I can swear by but these textbooks i have i downloaded them and i used them and they helped me in certain topics so one particular textbook was not just so sufficient for me so let's start with chartergia Chartergia textbook of medical biochemistry. This this one helped me a lot, especially in um um, um, um bio molecules, the chemistry of bio, bio molecules. That's chemistry of proteins, chemistry of of um, carbohydrates, and blah 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 blah. Chemistry of lipids. So this textbook helped me when I was re reading that topic. Then BRS biochemistry too helped me. That's blood review service biochemistry. That's like something you go to when you want to do quick revision then vasu divan hi this vasu divan is it was a blessing to my life god it helped me in so so many topics i kept going back to it so this is one textbook that helped me a lot then another textbook that helped me so much was um satyana rayana <laughs> i don't know if this person is an indian or this person is is from pakistan but the the name is very funny but yet the textbook helped me a whole lot satyana rayana's biochemistry it helped me a lot like I'm, I'm not even joking i kept going back to it for several topics then um hapas hmm, i have hapas hard copy that was a waste of my parents hard earned money <laughs> this textbook and uh, this hapas is for gurus me that don't know about chemistry what am i doing with her past i don't know i don't know what made me buy that textbook if you're a guru in biochemistry if you're a boss in biochemistry her past is okay for you but people like us that don't know about chemistry that are try, trying to learn it from scratch please these other textbooks worked for us then another textbook for 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 bosses leaping cuts leaping cuts um biochemistry this one is another textbook that's for bosses you know if you if you read leaping cut and you understand that you're a boss you shouldn't be even worrying yourself about biochemistry you've passed already <laughs> another textbook textbook of biochemistry with clinical correlations by thomas m devlin this in this is another textbook for bosses then the last textbook for bosses is learning jazz biochemistry this last three or four um, textbooks that i've mentioned this one is for bosses like but for people who are who want to learn biochemistry from scratch who don't really know about chemistry i want to learn it from scratch chateja will help you satya narana abi will help you brs will help you and vasu divan will help you those four textbooks are for people who want to learn from scratch people like me who do not really know about chemistry then for physiology ah physiology see this textbook i want to mention it it's not so many people's favorite but it is my own favorite and it helped me a lot essential physiology sembulingam jp essentials of medical physiology hi this one i have i have the hard copy of this textbook and it was not a waste of money at all because i kept running back in fact nearly every single topic in physiology i kept running running back to this textbook to study the, the, the textbook because it's easy straight to the point nice catchy diagrams nice flow charts 
did not give unnecessary details ah no 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 i would strongly suggest for beginners start from essentials then if you're a boss because i know there's a particular textbook that my school called it the um physiology the bible many of my lecturers kept referring us back to this text which i tried studying no jokes but almost it was just wasting my time i couldn't even finish a topic in a whole day that's how i couldn't understand this text so this textbook is for bosses if you're a boss you know this textbook is for you guyton and hall textbook of medical physiology so if you're a boss and you're able to study this textbook and understand it please cut soap for us this textbook is for others but not for me the only thing that made me refer open this textbook at all was when i the hype was too much and i was like what's it with this textbook that people are hyping it like this i opened it and oh you know work for me oh. but that doesn't mean it won't work for you try it it could work for you then another textbook ganon G ganon's review of medical physiology this textbook is another textbook for physiology bosses boss them please go for it check it if, if it will work for you then the last but not the least is brs physiology so yes brs physiology as usual that's board review series physiology this is a textbook that you go for if you want to do revision so please these textbooks that i'm i'm telling you about a textbook that i used that i have opened before i'm not going to come here and mention any textbook that i don't have this textbook, a textbook I, I, I sat down, opened my laptop to copy down the textbook that I used my hard and data to download. So that is to tell you how important these textbooks are to me. Then please, I'm sure I've not mentioned all textbooks. If there's any textbook that helped you in your preclinical classes or that you are still in preclinicals and they are helping you, just put them down in the comment section. Don't hoard this knowledge. I am not a fan of hoarding knowledge. If something helped you, if something works for you, share it. Let other medical students benefit from it. So if you watch this video to this point, I'm really grateful. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to my channel if you like my content. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Check out my other medical school um, study tips videos. In that, There's a particular playlist. Please check it out. And please put on that notification bell. If you don't put it on, when my video is coming, it will get missing. Put on notification bell so that youtube will inform you when i have a new video i remain your girl jemima bye <laughs> yes i totally forgot to add that the next video i'm going to upload is going to be my mock exam question paper i'm going to discuss the questions we were asked i was asked and give you possible um, outlines and how you're supposed to go about it if probably you encounter such questions in your upcoming exams so these are those things i'm trying to do to help you guys sit up because it's one thing to actually know the answer and another thing to get it correct